Hello there, good morning, good afternoon, and good evening. So on this video, we're going to talk about Gmail AA new features, Gmail AA tutorial. So right here, as you can see, I'm currently inside my Zomi Google account, or Gmail if you may. And you can see right here that I have a very simple email for you guys. So I've made it very simple, even if there's going to be grammatical errors, because I want to show you the main topic for today. Since it's going to be AI, make sure you have your Gmail up and you have everything set up. What I mean by everything set up is you have a sample basic email to work with. So once we're here, please notice on the bottom section, we have some tools, right? And you'll notice this one, the one that says, help me write. It's like a pencil with a sparkle or a diamond, if you may. Simply click on this one and you're going to have different choices. You have polish, formalize, elaborate, shorten, and basically help me write. So for this video, we're going to focus on polish. If I click on this one right there, it's now currently recreating what I did in the above section. Remember guys, I made a very basic email here, and this is what it polished. So I am writing you to inform that we will not have any work days from May 5, 2024 to September 1 of 2021. Regards, Anthony. Now you notice that on the regards section, I type in Bart. And how come it gave me Anthony? Because Anthony is the name of my Gmail account. So even though I type in a different name, I type in a different person's name, it always comes down to the what is my name on my Gmail account. That is extremely helpful. Now, for example, you're not satisfied with what you have here for Polish, you can simply click on Recreate. And it's still going to give you another prompt. And with that being said, you can also refine. For example, you want to formalize, elaborate, or shorten. For example, guys, I want to click on Formalize right there. What it does is, as the name suggests, it has been formalized. So that is going to be the Unpolish for you. If I click on Insert right there, this is going to be my new email. I can delete this one to work with this. It's going to be easy as that. Now, for some reason, you're not seeing this pencil icon. You need to enable your Google Workspace Labs. So I'm going to go to the website right now. Now, welcome back to the video. Now, this is going to be the Workspace Labs, and this is entirely for free. Make sure you type in this Google link right there or URL. You can pause the video, you can copy this, and go at the very bottom section. Make sure you click on this three boxes, click on Submit, and without further ado, you are successfully signed in. That is how you toggle the Help Me Write feature in Google. Now, going back here, this is basically how to do the polish. But there is some reason here, for example, if you click on this, so let me just delete everything before I move on to the mobile devices. If I click on this one, basically names helps me write. So for example, this one, wish my friend a speedy recovery on the hospital. Click on enter. And it's just like entering a prompt in any image generation tool. It will give us some sample image to work with. And this is what we have here. I can still refine it shorten or formalize or i can simply click on insert now and if i click on insert here i can have this one just edit the name's friend your name and we'll be good to go and now this works entirely the same identical by the way with ios and android i'm gonna go to ios right now now welcome back to the video now you're seeing right here this is gonna be my dummy google account log into my ios it's basically the same as i have earlier so go to compose here now, what I mean by identically the same is that, if you notice, I still have that icon right there. So the most crucial part right here is that you're logged in to the Google Space first plan earlier. Now, once you're here, of course, go to Compose Email, and you'll notice that there is an option that says, Help me write. By simply swiping on the right icon right there, you can enter a prompt here. For example, wish my friend a speedy recovery. Simply click on Create. And with that being said, the AI will help you create your very own email. Now, it's the same process as the one on the computer. You can formalize, elaborate, or shorten. You can even click on regenerate by that icon right there. But for me, I think I'm satisfied with this one. I'm going to click on insert. And now, speaking about the polish, if I click on this icon right here, the pencil with the sparkle, I can now polish this one with whatever I have. Easy as that. If I click on replace right here, it will now replace the original email 
with the polished one. And basically that's how it works, both with the iOS and Android. And that being said, thank you so much for watching. Please hit the like button, subscribe. I'll catch you guys on the next one. Goodbye for now.